Hey there everyone, this is Zaukao playing ASMT. Last time I won more level into this level, which I've heard people claim to be outright like one of the hardest levels in the game. Right smack dab in the middle. So yeah, no, that makes sense. So for people out there who are not reading the comments, Sai Ninja has indicated it. Right now, if included the pit deaths, which were not counted in my original playthrough, the original Alcal was uh, would have been a 141 demos, even though it's also indicate 100 here. Hey there, Charlie. World five is a cave world. Hey there, Charlie is a very, very kind of uh, basic statement. 42 and 100. Wow. Uh, so here's the thing with Charlies. They are a sometimes enemy. Y you're really not meant to fight them all day, every day, all the time. But, back in the day, I had somewhat of a catchphrase that was, you know, Hey there, Charlie! Whenever Charlie was on the screen. And as such, people were incentivized to including this guy all over the place, including this Halo that is entirely dedicated to him, and me entirely dedicated to messing up easy jumps. I don't know, no excuses here. Ah, okay, you know what, that hurts. That frog is not called Charlie. This is kind of a cool little area where you go to zig and zag and there's baseballs. Like, World 5, the difficulty is gonna yank up. Like, we gotta remember, in the original playthrough at this point, I was at 100 demo, but like, deaths, not all deaths were counted, and I did end up with like 400 and something. Like, at some point, the difficulty gates get crashed through, and we are essentially playing an entirely different game altogether, and you have to be ready for that. Is there anything up here? I forget. Welcome to the bone country. Just a bunch of bones set up right here. When I think of Charlie in the cave, hey there Charlie, I think of bone stairs above lava. What country do you come from? Alright. Check it out, that guy is ready to pounce, check it out, I'm ready to hop on his head and make him run into the lava, he says no a lot, well he doesn't say it with his mouth, he says it using body language, which is shaking his head violently, that's just, people understand that to be a very negative feeling, wow, I, I don't know what I was thinking there, I think it's fair to say that there was not a lot of thinking there, I just kind of went, but, like I said, like, Charlie's a sometimes an enemy, but it's almost the only thing you encounter here, like, he's hard to deal with, you know, like, he covers a lot of space, throwing projectiles which cause uh, physical harm to your person, Something no one likes to happen to themselves or their loved ones. I know, hot take here, but uh, I'm putting it out there on the internet. These guys just falling from above, some of them missing their bone structure platform. Just uh, an overall real bad time for them. No one is enjoying themselves in the bone cave. There's a secret exit down there, and there is up there. You could see a lock and everything, but I remember the P-Switch opens a door somewhere or something. Maybe I'm misremembering? I genuinely am not sure. I guess we're gonna find out, because if you- basically you skip that level with a secret exit, <laughs> that's, that's, it's one of those uh, past the butter type of situations. You know what I'm talking about. I didn't make that one up. Alright, I'm just gonna let these guys fly. Do their own thing, that's fine. Look at that, I got myself a fireball, I'm gonna lose immediately. Like if it was a cape, at least we could swag these spheres around. Oh man, I'm dodging a cloud of enemy herb sprites again. But this time, uh, they're not nearly as uh, charismatic as big cute bees. All right, so I'm pretty sure there's a door somewhere going forward. Got like race there. Yeah, right here, right underneath the midpoint. So don't get the midpoint if you want a secret exit, I guess. Then you appear somewhere else. I don't understand. I found a key. Now I will fall. So you can get that star. 
kind of want it. So, I'll do those! There we go! But you can't, you don't run up, like, lives with Charlie. Like, with the footballs, I guess, but it's a big old gauntlet, and it's the bottom of the ninth, and Demo's got a key. Yeah, so don't get the midpoint. Because you need a P-switch here, so, you know, it's... It's a strange little situation that only exists in fiction and Venezuela. I don't know why that one's got a pan. Alright, let's do this the old-fashioned, very slow, but very safe way. I don't know what's old-fashioned about this. You know, that uh, grandpa's always complaining about how in the day they would jump up and throw fireball in the face of their enemies. Oh. Only in traditional context recreation style force clearings will you see such activities. Check it out, I'm here. We're the place where we people fall. Their arms are blue because it's cold. Check it out. There's really nothing to check out. That's why they're just looking around confused. Look at that. Whoa, you can kind of see it up on the screen ahead of time. How this wall doesn't have a little spotty splotch. That's how you know how to go to the next market next door. And then we clear the world and we get a shortcut, yo. Oh, that level. But first we gotta do this level. Like kill, I pr pressure point. It's one of those levels. There's no music at the end. You lose your power up immediately. These guys, like, <laughs> I got hurt in a dumb way. These guys are shoveling, uh, like, like I, I appreciate replacing the boulders with soccer balls. Like, it always bothered me as a kid that, well, yeah, your coins get reset, and that matters because your coin will decide the speed you move. Ah, jeez. Like, that's a decision that was made. Uh, but yes, video games may exist, but ask your mother first. Um, yeah, I forgot what I was going to say, but yeah. Like, so, oh, shoot. like, this is going to be a swimming level, but a swimming level that controls like a shmup. And, um, now nah, there's no black line around that telephone. Not enter, so I'm going to enter. But yeah, your speed determines how quickly you move. You want to go fast and not too fast, not too slow. If you press jump, you slow yourself down. It's like a focus in a toho. So I remember this being a thing. This is a pretty good start, if anything. Like, wow, masterful. Okay, so you do get more coins during your adventure, though. But you do lose some? Yeah, every once in a while. There we go. There we go, just dodge all day. Fish. And then here, I'm not sure, I guess I touched the back wall? That's what killed me? Sure, we'll go with that. I remember back then, finding it curious how you had a button to get slower instead of a button to get faster, but, like, I've played enough shmups nowadays to get it. To understand why that makes sense. It's like a precision button. Go. Oh, I went down too fast here. Ah, went too down too fast. Okay, so I need to press up to leave the ground then. I, I wasn't sure if it was necessary or not. Ah, this, like, this is hard because that. Like, this is so awkward. Like, it, it feels like it's not supposed to. Ah, uh, whatever. God damn it, why do I keep going so fast down like that? Ah, I don't know. I'm gonna hide as a constant. I can't, like, I can't. It's like you were never meant to be here big. But, like, I, I didn't bring the mushroom from outside the level, it came from within here. So, ooh, oh, there's probably a power up in there, huh? Yeah, I'm just kind of taking a path completely at random. Oh, I probably would have liked that fire flower. I was on a more diagonal path than I thought I was. It's a weird thing to say, but that's what it was. Just can't. I, I do not know what is the finger process you are expected to do there. 
Ah, dude, how? Like, see, like, the part that sucks about this level is the beginning part in the, in the, the dumb tunnel where, oh, sweet, okay, if you go there, I guess you're just dead. All right, so I don't want to go too high. It's just that I want to get to that fire flower once. Yeah, there's no way to get that beam. I'm not sure. Ah, dude! Oh, I think it's my big thumb. Sometimes when I press down, uh... Ah, dude, real Again, it's... Uh, whatever. It's, it's... It's so weird. <laughs> oh, man. So it's possible to make it here big. Sweet. It's impossible to touch that mailbox, though. Alright, yeah. Well, great, like, I tried ducking to duck, but, uh, 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 jeez, but it didn't work. I don't know if it's because I was, like, growing at a time, yeah, so here you do need that, like, ridiculous post-50 speed to be able to survive, but whatever, yeah, I died. Uh, yeah, this part is scary, it is super-duper scary, here, STUPID WALL! No! The wall could just push you, but no, it kills you. I don't know. Uh, Again, like, I I think I, like, just accidentally am... My thumb is somehow large enough that it's reaching all the way to the left. Somehow. Okay, I don't know if this is gonna matter, but it's gonna make this, like, a lot easier. So, yes. Because if I can take a hit during the Zoom Tunnel of Love... Feel real nice. Like it removes a lot of pressure. Well, there we go. Hey, yeah, there we go. Now that I know that the wall will kill me. Well, the thing is, I knew it would kill me. Don't press anything. I knew it was gonna kill me because we, we I've experienced that behavior later. But I don't know. Like I don't know. I don't know. I didn't think. Like this level is very well made but it's not well constructed. Do you understand what I mean there? The tech is genius. Like, and it works. Like, what it tries to do on a technical level works really well. I just think that, um, the obstacles are presented in the wrong order. Uh, it starts with a really, like, I understand that it wants to introduce the basic, and like, the first few screens do that, but a tunnel where you go up and down, and there's munchers at some places, and it's just like, whoa, 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 turbo tunnel, turbo tunnel. I think that part is kind of weak, and it's the part you're going to be playing a lot. Like, and that's really unfortunate, because after you're done with that part, I do believe the level is extremely interesting, and it's extremely thrilling. But, you know, you've been punched down a little bit before you get there, and it weakens the impression a little bit. This music is a bit longer than the other ones, isn't it? I oh, know. We're back to the start. <laughs> 